to do a stretch for the lats. It's going to be a stretch for the lats from a kneeling position, and we're going to be using a bench. In my case, I'm using a very low table. Um, it's going to be perfect height for me from a kneeling position. From here, what we're going to do is um, the lats are the muscles which attach from the uh, shoulders, from the back of the shoulder here, from the back of the arm to the spine. These are the muscles which um, do this motion. They pull your arm downwards like this. Um, and this muscle attaches all the way down your spine in a V-shape like this. And uh, that's the, kind of the side muscle that you often see sticking out right here on the side. Um, and we're going to try to stretch that muscle out. It's going to feel really good to get this stretch out. What you want to do is be kneeling on the floor. Um, and you want to have your toes pointing to the wall behind you so you're not sitting on your, on your toes. And we're going to lean forward to the bench. And what I'm going to do here is keep my back and my abdominals nice and tight, nice and straight. My palms are facing down for the start of the exercise. And I'm just going to slowly bend forward, put my head between my arms so that my uh, shoulders are in line with my ears, facing down. And I'm just going to slowly keep my back straight and then very gently kind of push my back into my hips to bring my body down. You should be able to feel a stretch just behind your shoulders, kind of on the side of your armpit here, going down. That's about where you're going to feel that stretch. This stretch can be held for 30 to 45 seconds. You can do a few reps of it. There's almost no such thing as too much stretching. People tend to hold a lot of stretches for about 10 seconds, but that's not as effective as holding it for a much longer time. Now to make it a little bit more challenging, we're going to turn our thumbs so your thumbs are facing up. And you should be able to feel a little bit more of a stretch. Remember here not to feel a, a pull or a pain when you stretch. You want it to be a very uh, comfortable position. If you feel it pulling, it's probably an overstretch. Now I'm going to turn my palms so they're facing the ceiling. And that is going to put the biggest amount of stretch on that muscle. And just slowly push downwards, being very gentle. And then we're going to bring it up. A very relaxing stretch. Um, a great stretch for the, for the back, for the upper back especially. Um, that is a, everything that you're going to need to know on how to do a kneeling lat stretch with a bench.